Hi kids! Welcome to Storytime. Uncle Jesse here. You know what time it is. Today we are talking about one of my favorite things to read and to watch. Talk about fight scenes! How do you write fight scenes? What's the best way to write fight scenes? Well, everyone has their own way, they have their own style, and depending what kind of fight scene and what kind of mood you want to evoke, there are different techniques, of course. But this is what I like to do. Uh, these are some philosophies I have to writing good fight scenes. If you want a fight scene that's uh, thrilling, exciting, and really just puts you in the moment, makes you feel like you're in it. All right? So here's a few techniques for writing good fight scenes. First of all, don't get too bogged down in the details. Don't describe every little move, every twist of the hips, jab, jab, cross, uppercut, double leg takedown. You don't have to describe every little thing that happens. Remember, part of good fiction is describing just enough that the reader can then fill in the rest with their own imagination. So I like to find a good balance, right? You want to describe some of the moves that are happening, but then kind of gloss over some of them. You want to focus more on the emotion of the scene and what's happening and what the characters are feeling than specific moves, okay? So that's, that's the first thing. The second thing is... Um, you want to get into the mind of the character. You want to remember the objective of the character and how does the fight scene reflect that. All right, a fight scene is not just about the fight that's happening, it's what's behind the fight that's happening. Okay? That's the second bit. It's never really about the fight. The last little bit is that you got to remember a fight is supposed to be fast and aggressive. All right? So your writing style in the fight scenes should be more fast and aggressive than you might have in the rest of your book. So you don't want to bog it down with long sentences, you don't want any big flowery words or descriptions, you just want short sentences to the point writing, you want the writing style itself to mirror the vibe of the fight. Right? So if you want quick, brutal, fast-paced fight, that's how your writing should be. Don't bore me with heavy descriptions, all right? So balance, nice, short, and tight. And now, uh, I don't know if I'm gonna shoot myself in the foot here or not, but if we're talking about fight scenes, I'm gonna read you an excerpt from my book, Skinner. There's a lot of fight scenes in Skinner. There's monsters, there's car chases, there's explosions, there's all kind of action and adventure, and uh, also some good old-fashioned fight scenes. So I found a good fight scene in here that kind of illustrates some of the points that I made. So, I'm going to read to you an excerpt from my book, Skinner, a novel by Jesse D'Angelo. <clears throat> okay. I'm not going to do any weird voices or act it out around. I'm just going to read, okay? Damn it, Shaw, stop it! You don't know what you're doing. No, but you know, he said, stalking towards her and you're going to tell me everything. He reached out to grab her, and she sprung forward, unleashing a rapid combination of punches at him. Two he blocked. The third connected with his jaw, jarring him back again. Rage flooded his veins. A familiar feeling made itself known. A knock at the door. Another presence within, trying to break free. What the hell am I, Janae? I'll tell you everything, I promise. Just what the hell am I? He lunged at her again his years of fight training useless in this emotional and confused state. She dodged to the side, a curved blade to his blunt weapon. She countered with several more blistering strikes, connecting to his face and body. He caught her last punch, kicking her legs out from under her and sending her to the floor with a smack. Janae was up in a flash. Janae was up in a flash, kicking again, driving him back. The rage boiled within him, overflowing. The loss of control was imminent. The knocking at the door had become a crashing, battering ram. All right, so that's just a little, little taste of a fight scene. So maybe you'll see what I was trying to talk about in my little philosophies of writing fight scenes in that little bit. And hopefully I did a decent job. You'd be the judge. And if you want to judge, guess what? Skinner's available for sale now on Amazon.com! So exciting! You can have your own copy! And you can get a signed copy by me if you want. You can contact me on 
Facebook or Twitter or Instagram. But if you want, you can go to Amazon, get this book or my other two books. The link is in the description below. Otherwise, like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell, shout it from the rooftops, tell everyone to come spend some time with creepy Uncle Jesse. Thanks for watching, children. See you next week.